guys ready? Well, this is it, folks. This is the big day. The historic day on which James Randi has promised to open his gates and shower gifts on the fine, lucky winners. From all over the globe, people have gathered here, waiting for the hour to strike, waiting to catch a glimpse of that legendary magician, Mr. James Randi. I'm so glad you could all come. <laughs> louder. Come with me and you'll see, louder please, what's a world of pure imagination. From this stage, we'll engage. Let's start that over, please. There it is. Start it again. Here we go. It's not really James Randi. Start it again, please. Start it again. Start it from the top, please. It's just a little stop button, and then you hit. No, just start the whole track over one more time. Please, there we go. Come with me, and you'll see What's a world of pure imagination? From this stage, we'll engage in a rational explanation. Big footprints and aura's tints are all made of pure imagination. A dowsing stick, chiropractic, won't find water or a subluxation. Simply take a look and view it. First observe and then think through it. The truth is weird enough. Please don't add to it. <laughs> Thermite paint, a weeping saint, a fortune teller's prognostication, a B12 shot, Prometheus's plot are all made from pure imagination. A spoon that bends, apocalyptic ends, cures through Asian needle application, healing touch, it's all too much when you deal with imagination. It seems like Wu is marching at a bright pace, but it's time for an about face. Want to fight the fakes? You're in the right place. So, come with me and we'll see what is real. And what's imagination? Here I am. This is. <laughs> it's me, guys. the track playing. Keep it going. There we go. I gotta sing about the guy we all know and love. Because it's, you know, I'm just a poor imitation of the one and only. Who 
can take a person spouting off some woo. Prove to everybody that they're full of number two, the Randy Man. Yes, the Randy Man can. Oh, the Randy Man can, cause he's got a rational plan to fight the fakers good. Who can take a psychic that once threatened to sue? Make her go on TV and promise to do things she will never do. The Randy Man. Yes, the Randy Man can. The Randy Man can, cause he's got a rational plan to fight the fakers good. You know, the Randy Man takes everyone who fakes to task without exception. Talk about extra perception. He can always sense deception. Who can take an expert? That's been fooled himself Calmly rip apart the proof Like some tiny demonic elf The Randy Man That's right, the Randy Man can Who could tell you the secret To how Kreskin predicts He can teach you fact from fiction While performing magic tricks The Randy Man Oh yes, the Randy Man can The Randy Man can Cause he's got a rational plan to fight the fakers good You know, the Randy Man's shown Both the broad and home The cost of woo and how to remove it Supernatural power's real and you've it There's a million bucks if you can prove it Key change so help us hype the fakers in ways they've never seen. We'll teach you how to do it at TAM 2013 with the Randy Man. The James Randy Man here at TAM. Yes, it's the James Randy Man. And he's here at TAM. Hopefully you'll all be singing that by the end of the weekend. All right, every year I say the same thing. There might be time for a question at the end of someone's talk. If there's time for a question, there's just one thing I ask, and the Oompa Loompas are going to help me out this year. Take it away, boys. Make sure that your question's a question, not a story, a yarn, or a tale. It should have a point and be nice and concise, or else we'll throw you in question jail. That's right. We're sure that your story's quite special. We're sure that your view is unique. But folks have paid big bucks to hear expertise and not watch time run out while you speak. Make sure that your question's a question. Make sure that it doesn't run long. And if it turns into an endless rant, we will start singing this song. We're gonna sing this song. Ready, here it goes. Tammy, Rammy, Tammy, Tuss, get to the point, cause you're boring us. Tammy, Rammy, Tammy, too, ask what you want, but enough about you. Make sure that your question's a question, cause brevity is what we need. When thinking about what you're going to say, think less blog and more Twitter feed. Make Tammy, sure that you're... Rammy, no, not here, guys. Tammy, no. ten. We can't believe it's the same song again. No, it's Tammy, what? Tammy, whammy, Tammy, tear. Isn't this just what you sang last it's year? It's a little different from last Tammy, year. It's a little Rammy, different. Tammy, Tammy, Tig. Write something new or you might lose this gig. You think I might? Tammy, Rammy, Tammy, Tuck. That's what you get when you hire a ball. Okay, thank you, thank you. That's great, that's great. You know what? Let's just start the show, I think, is a good idea. So let's kick off the program and get us on our way. Let me tell you, I'm so honored to be the first to say, welcome to TAM. Welcome to TAM with the Randy Man. 
Are you guys ready for a great weekend? You guys set? All right. We're going to bring out the president of the JRAF, my good friend. Please welcome DJ Grothy. Thank you, George Trab. Welcome, everyone. Uh, it's so good I can't see you right now. You guys are uh, coming in. People are still flooding in from breakfast. It is my pleasure to welcome all of you to the amazing meeting this year. What I'm really excited about is uh, how many folks are coming from all over. So uh, as of uh, uh, Wednesday at 3 p.m., I don't have the uh, uh, updated numbers right now. We have just over 1,100 people joining us this weekend. Very excited about that. And what really encourages me is that just over half of the people here this weekend are here for the first time. So that, uh, that suggests to us that the amazing meeting isn't just a family reunion, but it's also sort of an outreach event. It's a way to uh, share this message of critical rationality with new folks. We also have uh, people from all over the world here in Vegas for these four days. Australia, Belgium, Canada, Costa Rica, Denmark, Finland, Germany, Iceland, India, Japan, Kenya, Mexico, New Zealand, Norway, Philippines, Poland, Romania, South Africa, Spain, Sweden, Switzerland, and the United Kingdom. This is an international event. And almost every state in the United States except seven. So I will mention them so, uh, so they can feel appropriately chagrined. Uh, West Virginia, Tennessee, Rhode Island, Montana, Mississippi, Delaware, and Arkansas. So if anyone is here from those states, uh, let us know so we can correct the record. <clears throat> What I'm really, really excited about this year is that almost 10% of the people joining us this weekend are here at no cost to them for their registration because of the generosity of a number of folks. I'm talking about the JREF Forum Grants, our online community, come together every year to uh, raise some money to help folks get here who otherwise couldn't afford it. We had edu educator grants this year for the first time to help teachers get here. Very excited about that. The Rising Star Grant, Sarah Mayhew's program to identify young talent and help uh, get them to TAM, cultivate uh, the next generation of skeptic talent. So I want to thank Sarah Mayhew, the JREF uh, Forum, uh, folks like Brian Walker, who helped get people here. The Honest Liar documentary crew made it possible for a few folks to come here at no charge. A lot of people came together to help, again, almost 10% of us come at no cost to them. So thank you to those uh, generous helpers. <clears throat> and I also want to thank uh, the sponsors of the amazing meeting this year. If you go near the back page of your program, uh, you'll see a list of the sponsors and the supporters who helped make TAM 2013 a reality. This could not have happened without all of these organizations coming together and supporting the JREF to put on this great event, especially the John W. Carson Foundation. And I want to, although the support of everyone was important, I want to especially single out uh, Michael Shermer and the Skeptic Society, who again this year really bent over backwards to, in, in, in a sense, we're partnering on, on TAM this year, and Skeptic Magazine is the official magazine of the amazing meeting. Without Michael uh, and without the Skeptic Society and his team there, uh, the amazing meeting would not be what it is. So let's hear it for the sponsors for the Skeptic Society. Thank you. It is my pleasure to introduce the man without whom, literally, this event would not uh, be happening. Every day, and that's no exaggeration, you know, we're skeptics, we're sort of professional truth tellers. We try not to exaggerate, stretch the truth, confabulate. So when I say every day, I mean every day, or, well, just about every day. Maybe we've missed one. We get 
emails from folks all over the world who talk about how the person I'm about to introduce you to has made a real difference in their lives, changed their lives for the better. And uh, now people are also talking about not just Randy the man, but the organization that Randy founded and the work that the James Randy Educational Foundation is able to accomplish, inspired by him, led by him, really following his direction uh, to advance skepticism in the public interest. Uh, Randy is not just an inspiration, uh, he is a frustration, let me tell you how. Uh, he is a paranormal event unto himself. Randy will call me some mornings, four in the morning, and hey, let, let, let's think about this, and we gotta do that, and what's the next thing? And he's up later than everybody, up before everybody, up later than everybody. Randy uh, has energy that uh, really merits the million dollar prize. Uh, last year, as an example, Randy traveled speaking on skepticism and working with local skeptics groups and national skeptics groups to India, Australia, Spain, Italy, Germany, Mexico, Honduras, uh, I think Belize, uh, uh, just all over the world. He did a nine, a couple years ago, he did a nine city tour of Canada in nine days. And he's 85 years old this year. Uh, he has energy that is worth celebrating and it is an inspiration. It's only a frustration when it's 4 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> so please join me in welcoming again the man without whom literally this event would not be happening. Join me in welcoming my friend, our inspiration, James Randi. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's very heartwarming, to say the least. You notice that every time I step to a podium, I have to lower the microphone a foot. <laughs> really. But we little guys, it's a lot of quality tied up in a very small body, you see. Welcome. I, I say that from the bottom of my heart. I look out over a crowd like this and it really warms, warms my whole body. There's not much here to warm, but it's very warm at the moment, I can tell you. I am so privileged to say hello to you and to welcome you formally at TAM 2013. I won't be long, I just want you to know that I'm thrilled to see you here and exceedingly flattered. Ladies and gentlemen, be sure that you meet every one of your neighbors that you possibly can. It's important. Meet them, shake their hands, say a few kind words to them, take down some names and addresses and email addresses so that you can stay in touch. We are an organization that needs to be in touch and we are in the communications age, so ladies and gentlemen, take full advantage of that. I'll be seeing a great deal of each and every one of you, I hope, in the next little while, and uh, let's make the most we can of TAM 2013. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. 